And then I woke up one morning and the penguin penalty, or sorry, penguin update wiped out all of our SEO traction for years. So there is a reason I am this way. This is not because I'm a Google suck up. This is because I'm an SEO professional and I want the sites that I work on to succeed. I want my clients to succeed. This is why I'm always thinking about the most risk averse way to approach SEO because I hate seeing websites that are legitimate businesses who are trying to do things right, get affected by Google updates. But as we can all see by now, it happens all the time because people don't understand what Google's really suggesting to do or not do in many cases. But if you read between the lines that the patterns are very, very clear. So my team and I have been working for years, helping websites recover from poor updates, penalties, manual actions, all of this. So what I share is what I've learned during that journey. Anyway, the spam updates that started getting sent out this week, Google's using what's called a pure spam update for many of these types of sites. This can be applied to your entire domain. It can be applied to a subfolder or a subdomain. And this has been happening. In fact, just that has been happening this week. There's been many sites that have been hit on the domain level. So if you do a site colon search for their site, the whole thing is removed from search. The rankings are removed from search. 